Hey, 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 y'all. This is Bradley of Bradley Teaches, and welcome to my Vlogmas. We're having a great time, and I know you guys are watching the videos, and I definitely appreciate that. And a question came through about animations. They asked me, is there a way that you can have your animation go off the screen as well as come on the screen? And I said, hey, that'd be a great thing to do for a Vlogmas, right? So I'm going to combine some magic move features and some of the build in build out animation features into one project. So let's jump into keynote and make that happen. Y'all. All right. So here we are in keynote again, our trusted application. So let's jump in. We're going to drag, select all that stuff and delete it. I need to knock down my slide size some, and I'm going to turn on my ruler, Apple R. Now today, instead of that lower third and that kind of stuff, we're going to build a sidebar because it'll be great, especially for a day like today is Sunday. A lot of scripture and things like that that people can use this for or quotes and things like that. So when you want to have more text on the screen that may fit in a typical lower third, sidebars are a great option. So we're going to build one of those today. And let me drag this over to roughly 640. And let's go shape for the box that our most of our text will be in. That's a good size. And let's open up our object palette. I'm going to option drag. We're going to get a bottom bar on that. And we'll make it smaller. And let's colorize that red for now. We'll come back to it. And we're going to option drag and get us a top bar. All right. So we got a bottom bar and a top bar. Let's make that bottom bar. We can leave it red. Let's stay with the Vlogmas theme. Make it a little bit thinner. All right. And we're going to do the top bar green. Now, this is something that I planned on showing you guys later, but I don't want you to get tired of building these things because you think they're really kind of blocky and all that kind of stuff. So let me show you a cool little trick that you can do to customize your shapes. Click on the shape, right click on it and click make editable. Now you get these little special um, draggable boxes now. And if I hold down shift, I now have an angled box. Ta-da. Now I'm going to do a Vlogmas later on making custom shapes and things. I'm going to just throw you guys a little something today for right now. All right. So let's make the box gray. We'll just do gray. All right. And let's go ahead and make this slide transparent now. So no feel. So that's what our box will look like, right? Knock down the opacity just a little bit. A little see-through box. All right. So this is our final design. All right. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go over here to the slide palette, copy, paste. Now, number two is our action slide, right? Well, most of the action is going to happen. So let's go backwards to number one. And I'm going to zoom out a little more and we're going to pull all these pieces off the screen. And I'm going to drag this one down. And uh, let's go to format or range on that. And I'm going to spin it some, make it spin onto the screen. Let's get it off the screen some more. All right. And you know what? Let's make the green one kind of come from over here. All right. So now we have that slide selected again. We're going to go to animate and we're going to go to magic move and you'll see it happen. There we go. So we just built our sidebar automatically, right? So we're not going to, we're going to go to automatically and we're going to make this at about two seconds. So that means once I start my movie, two seconds later, it's going to animate in my sidebar. And let's preview that again. Two seconds go by, animates in, right? So now we're done with that. So now we're in the active layer of our sidebar. So now we're going to add some other animation features, right? So let's go to text. Let me drag this over here and double click that. And because this is sidebar, sidebars are really good for having a lot of text if you need a lot of text, right? So I'm going to say uh, a great quote. So that's going to be the text we put in this box here. We're going to go to format and we're going to kick that text up. That's a decent size and we're going to make it white. And let's change the font to
All right. A great quote from a famous person. Right. So that's going to be our text that's going to show up in our box. So I'm going to click that and we're going to go to the animate palette now and we're going to go to build in and we want that text to animate in as a keyboard typing. I like that. Good with the cursor about three seconds. That's cool. So now that that's done, let's go to build order so we can see it all. And now we're going to go to build out and we're going to make it pop out. Let's say pop. I like that too. About three quarters of a second. Cool. So now we have the build in, build out. And let's drag the build out into the build in. And it's going to happen after that. Let's go about three seconds. Long enough for people to read it. Well, let's go four seconds. All right. And let's preview that. It's going to build in. Stay for four seconds. Then build out. All right. So that's one great quote. So we're going to go back over here to our object list. Now I'm going to option drag. And then let's put it on the bottom so we can not get annoyed by it. And we're going to go to this top one here and we're going to say another. Another great quote from a famous person. All right. And we can now drag that one back up here. All right, so we have a great quote and another great quote. So we're going to drag the another great quote under a great quote in the um, <laughs> build order, right? Drag that up inside. The next one comes in after that. After that leaves, we're going to have that come in about two seconds, right? So now let's preview all of that. A great quote comes in. Stays for about four seconds, animates out. The next quote comes in. Stays for about three seconds, animates out. And that's a great way to show a lot of text, right? In one sidebar by having different things animate in, animate out. So now that portion is done. So we're going to go back over here to our slide again. We're going to copy, paste the slide. So now we're going to operate in slide number three. So the first thing you can do is just delete all the text because we don't need it anymore. So now we're going to animate out all of our parts. So let's zoom out again. And I'm going to have the sidebar slide back off where it came from. We're going to have the bottom bar. Let's have it slide out of the top and we'll have the green bar slide kind of at an angle off the bottom, right? So we got the green bar selected. I'm going to angle that so we can get a little spin on it. And we're going to also change the color because we can. All right. Then the red bar, we're going to make it tiny, tiny, tiny as it moves off the screen and we'll make it gold. So they're going to change colors and do that. Right. So we have our magic move in animation when we're there. And now we need to magic move that off. So we go to that middle slide now. Animate. Add an effect, magic move, and you'll see the pieces leave the screen, right? So we're going to have it after transition automatically. And I'm not doing my math good now, so let's just do that about seven seconds, maybe eight. My math may be off. It may do it a little bit too early, but don't worry about it. You can just kind of go adjust those things, right? So there we are. We have magic move to make our sidebar sidebar text comes in and out of the sidebar then we magic move to an empty screen so now we got all the pieces done and go to file export to movie zero zero for next slide next build make sure it's apple ProRes 4444 as usual we're going to go next on that and we're going to call this one side b for sidebar desktop export it OK, so now we're ready to go to our main screen. Let's go back to our main screen here and I'm going to turn off my bottom bar and it's playing right now. Right. Two seconds animates in our text animates in leaves. Next text animates in then leaves. And then finally, our sidebar will animate off the screen. So there you have it. Magic move in, magic move out 
and then predetermine a more manual animation in the middle. I am Bradley Vinson, Alana's Papa. Be blessed, be free, y'all. Be good to yourself. Be good to each other. Hope you enjoyed it. Come back and see me tomorrow. Have a good one. Bye-bye. <laughs>